this video will highlight how you can use an affordable Windows based product, Mac Sport, to produce a synergetic workflow between machines, platforms and other timeline based products. I will be using the very affordable Basic Plus version of Mac Sport's suite of products to begin. I can capture live, access previous analyses from the database and create and share my training sessions. Here I will start a new register by using any move file type that is on my computer. I create my categories template dependent on the clips and data I need by using a mix of categories and descriptors which are highly modifiable in an easy manner. When I'm ready, I can start to register actions and see my analysis unfold in the category template and register control. When I finish my analyses, I can move to the timeline environment where I can access a matrix displaying my categories and descriptors and easily move and manipulate my clips by clicking and dragging. I can add some powerful drawings to highlight my point directly onto a clip in the timeline or perhaps add more later on whilst making a presentation of relevant clips with notes and drawings over my footage that can easily be exported with preset outputs, making it ready for online uploads to athlete management file sharing sites such as Team Performance Exchange. I can utilise some statistical outputs and also export the XML file which I will save onto my USB. With the source movie that I captured live or already had stored on my computer saved onto my USB along with the associated XML file, I can transfer this to another PC or Mac as seen here. Whilst on this machine, I can use a popular Mac based timeline product to open up my source movie in a timeline. I can then also import the XML I exported from Mac Sport onto this timeline so that I am seeing exactly the same timeline data I created on my PC with Naxport. I can edit this data or add more, then as with Naxport, export the XML file created on this machine. As before, I put this XML file and source movie onto my USB so that I can now transfer these files in the other direction, Mac to PC. Using the menu in Naxport, I choose to import an XML file. I firstly select the XML file to import from my own files, then choose a name for the database file I'm about to create before selecting the source movie associated with the XML. I open the timeline to see my clips, matrix and data which I can continue to edit further, rounding off the transfer of analyses from platform to platform and program to program. Also note that through using dual boot and parallels for example, I can run Naxport on my Mac, rather than being confined to just having a PC to make the software work. The Naxport Basic Plus product shown here is a really powerful tool that is also very affordable, with a one-off purchase price of £470. Another really powerful and affordable product made by Naxport is their viewer system which only costs £250. Using the import of XML files functionality shown before, it provides members of a team the chance to use a view-only product to review their analyses for the timeline and associated matrix. Bear in mind that this functionality is not confined to the sporting environment, as it can also be utilised by industries and organisations wanting to get the most out of their working practice. As you can see with this product, the big boys toys have now been made affordable for all from the grassroots levels up. Naxport's video analysis systems can provide cross-platform and program synergy, which can underpin existing workflows and provide teams and organisations with the opportunity to make a greater return on their existing investments. For more information on what was shown here, 
please leave a comment or send a mail to info at visualperformanceanalysis.com.